So it's 18.28 p.m. It is Sunday evening, and I'm going to run off a few movie reviews. Can't do them together. They have to be separate, because if you don't know, and you're new to my channel, my laptop has taken a turn for the worse. Yeah, it no longer connects to the Wi-Fi at all. So I can't make my fancy thumbnails anymore until further notice. Fuck. Hate that shit. So, first up, we have Summer of Sam from 1999, a Spike Lee joint. I love this movie. I watched this back in 2016, so I finished it. It's the tits. Yeah. Love me a Spike Lee joint. I love that. Dude, his work is so good. You can't go wrong with it at all. Even though it didn't make budget, it delivered in many different ways. The realism aspect, Son of Sam killings, the paranoia, graphic sex, and dialogue. That's what's missing in cinema today. It really is. Because if you compare shit from uh, back then to now, it's very tame. It really is. Even Edward Norton himself said I that he would pit 1999 versus any year or decade. And it was the best because 99 had some of the best bangers out there. And a lot of them went unnoticed, too. Mmm. That's so fucking good. Strawberry banana. Body armor. Freeze these. They're really good when they're frozen. Oh my god. Mm. So, yeah. Oops. Stupid cat. <laughs> yeah, there's so much missing today. Like, you can make any sappy romance flick. Kids in the back. <laughs> Uh, murder mystery, psych thriller, horror story, but they miss the realism in it. And the in-your-face attitude that only Spike Lee can give. Totally getting this movie down the road. Haven't bought it yet. <laughs> but yeah, Spike Lee is unique in his style because he's unabashed, unhinged in different aspects. And his camera style is so unique. Like, he doesn't do... I'm trying to think. His style is so signature that you can trace it back to Francis Ford Coppola, in a sense. Because Coppola was all about um, moving shots and keeping it either still frame or following as best he could. And there was one that was done, I can't remember what film it was, but it was so good. Because it was a circular shot, and I loved that so much. But yeah, so Summer of Sam. How would I rate this? Definitely 8, 6 out of 10. It's good shit. I haven't watched it in a long time, though, but I had a good time back in 2016. So yeah, and it was John Leguizamo, um... I forget who else was in it. It was one of those all-star joints. Like, when it's Spike Lee, you're going to get an all-star cast in that, no matter what. <laughs> Shit. So, you don't like him, you don't like his work, that's cool. It's understandable. Now everybody's a Spike Lee fan. Me, I love his work. His body of filmography, peak. Every time. No matter what year it is, it's peak. So, eh, check it out. See how you feel. I'll be back with some more. Stay tuned.